Hello and a very warm welcome. Pay Gasly, I deserve a chance at Red Bull again. And you can't really argue with him. He's been performing sensational and arguably driver of the season. He's become very consistent week in, week out. And he regularly hammers his rookie teammate, Yuki Tsunoda. Gasly, desperate for another chance. We all know what happened the first time. He was shot to bits, shot of confidence. And he was not the same driver. Now, Alpha Tauri really suits him. He's the team leader. He's a Grand Prix winner. Podiums with this team. He got better results in Alpha Tauri than he did Red Bull. Um, but yeah... The article, I deserve a chance at Red Bull, says Peer Gasly. Peer Gasly says he feels he deserves another chance to drive for Red Bull, insisting that his form this year for AlphaTauri has been better than when he was previously given the seat. And you can't argue with that. Um, yeah, he has been performing sensational. Norris Gasly, driver of the season. I think Carlos Sainz deserves a shout out, but he goes under the radar. Gasly was promoted from Toro Rosso to Red Bull for 2019, but demoted back to the squad mid-season, replaced by Alex Albon. We all know what happened there. Um, yeah, Alex Albon took the wheel, and then he got replaced by Perez. So we've had a lot of drivers uh, being given a chance. Kvyat. Albon, Gasly, none of them took their chance really. Kvyat was harsh because at least Kvyat got podiums, but it was the right decision to put Max in, clearly. So, Gasly, yes, I think I've performed at a very good level this season. Better than I did in 2018 when I was given the opportunity. Performing at a better level, more experienced. And based on this year, I could I could have deserved a better chance. But that is the decision and it doesn't stop my motivation. I've been in Sergio's position. It's part of a career perspective. Obviously, Red Bull and Alpha Tauri are signed up. But let's be real. Gasly wants another chance at Red Bull. And yeah, don't be surprised if he leaves the programme. I could see Gasly at McLaren. My goal is to be in Red Bull, and there's no surprise in that. I want to be in a car which allows me to fight for wins, podiums. That's always the target. I want to be world champion. So they made their decision. I'm happy for them. They are having a very successful season. I will keep pushing and try to take my chance in the future. I want to fight for world championship. He, he's been fantastic this season. Uh, Gasly, 74 points and needs just one more point to beat his total of 2020. Um, yeah, Speaking ahead of Austin, I've not had great races in Austin. The best I did was 10th. But yeah, um, very consistent driver. Um, he deserved to be dropped from Red Bull, but you cannot argue against his claim that he deserves another chance in Red Bull. More experienced, been on the podium, knows what it feels like to win the race, and that's why we've got the win at Monza on the f like as the thumbnail also. So, Pierre Gasly, ninth in the championship on 74 points. Yuki Tsunoda, 14th on 18. So, Gasly is a cut above. So comment down below your thoughts on Pierre Gasly. Does he deserve another chance at Red Bull? Red Bull have got their lineup sorted, but who knows in the future? Perez Max is a solid lineup. Does Gasly need to leave the program and go his own way? Um, yeah, but he's been very consistent. I've I have um people. I think it was F one. F1 fan gamer was it that said Gasly was overrated? Um, yeah, I love I love all the opinions of people. It's great. Um, I think it was F1 fan gamer. Someone said he was overrated. 
Um, yeah, but there's no doubt in consistent performances this season. We see what the future holds for Gasly. Join me later. Um, recording this in the morning, Friday. We go to work. We get back at 5 o'clock and then practice starts at half 5. Lucky for me. Um, yeah. So join me later for practice reaction. Adios.